Maharaja Jang Bahadur Rana is a significant figure in the history of Nepal. He was the Prime Minister and virtual ruler of Nepal from 1846 to 1877 who established the powerful Rana dynasty of hereditary Prime Minister. He was a man of courage and ability who gained control over the government after killing a usurper Gagan Singh in 1846 due to which he was named Prime Minister for life and given the hereditary title of Rana. He also remained a firm friend of the British throughout his life. It was his diplomatic skill and conciliatory policy which helped Nepal remain independent while the rest of the Indian subcontinent came under British rule. So, this time we gonna see 5 crazy facts about John Bahadur Rana. Before we begin, let me throw a short disclaimer. All the information in this video is based on the articles published online, so, if I get wrong, feel free to correct me. Now, let's begin. Number 5, Horse Lover. John Bahadur Rana was from military background and that may be the reason behind his interest in arms ammunitions, sports, hunting and horse riding. Out of all his interests, his favorite was horse riding. Yes, he was kind of obsessed with horse. He used to ride horse wherever he traveled and in fact he had ordered 30 Arabian horses from India. Well he seemed fond of horse, isn't it? Number 4. He is not John Bahadur Rana. Yes, you heard it right. John Bahadur Rana is not John Bahadur Rana. I mean, his real name is Veer Narsing Kunwar, but he got famous by the name John Bahadur which was given to him by his maternal uncle, Mathabar Singh Thapa. Number 3, First PM to Britain. John Bahadur Rana was the first Prime Minister to visit Britain. During his time, traveling west was a bit tough, he completed his journey on ship which took him almost four months. In another context, it is documented that he almost spent £250,000 while staying in Britain. Number 2, Crazy Visit. John Bahadur was not only the first PM to visit Britain but also his visit was crazy and bit awkward too. During his visit, he took a lot of things with him. I really mean a lot of. He took a flower pot with people tree in it, 40 brass pots to store holy water and cow for milk. He also took rice and pulses enough for months. It's not enough. He also took 42 people with him who were all pure Hindu. Well, he started the trend of making jumbo team. Furthermore, he used to dine separately, cause he was high caste Hindu and he also used to milk the cow himself. Yes, he acted awkward. Never mind, despite his crazy visit, he was able to bring some modernization in Nepal's culture, art, lifestyle and even law after returning from Britain. Now, let's move to the last of the list. Number 1, Love in Britain. Are you committing me? <laughs> During his historic visit to Britain, John Bahadur Rana, the athletic, dark and handsome ruler, fell in love with one Irish beauty, Laura Bell. John Bahadur was so deep in her love that he also managed to give her a good house. His fondness for Laura Bell grew and he lavished one expensive gift after another on her. As the date of departure drew near, John expressed his desire to stay longer in Britain but his brothers were successful in persuading him to return to Nepal, fearing a political accident. Leaving Laura Bell behind was heartbreaking. It is said that, Zhang's parting gift was an expensive diamond ring with a promise to fulfill her every wish. Well, he was a great lover. To read more about his love story, visit the link in the description. So, that were some crazy facts about one of the significant figures in the history of Nepal. Hope you enjoyed the video. That's it for this time, subscribe if you haven't and don't forget to like and share the video, good time.